Hi, I'm Mark from ESE Direct. Today we're looking at the Sealy 27kg capacity walk behind broadcast salt spreader. The salt spreader arrives flat packed in a carton just like this one. The pack weight is 5.5 kgs. This salt spreader uh, can be relatively easily assembled by one person. Okay, so what's it for and what's it best for? Uh, you would use this salt spreader and this particular size for organisations or individuals where you've got a small to medium sized outside area to cover. Uh, this spreader, um, it's termed a broadcast salt spreader because it has a rotating plate underneath the hopper where the uh, salt will fall through and as you push the spreader along so the rotating plate underneath broadcasts the salt uh, over the area required to be treated. With this salt spreader there are two main features which helps the flow of salt through the hopper and onto the plate. The first is a rotating disperser pin which is mounted inside the hopper at the base and this loosens the salt and helps it fall through the adjustable holes in the base of the hopper. Um, those holes are adjusted using this lever. In the fully forward position the holes are closed off so that salt won't fall through the base of the hopper. Um, as you want to increase the flow of salt from the hopper onto the distribution plate, you simply pull the lever back and this gradually opens the holes in the base of the hopper. You can set the position in place by use of this stop, which is adjustable and locks in position with a wing nut. The volume capacity of this particular spreader is large enough to take a full 25 kilo bag of salt and the width of spread for this particular model is 3 to 3.6 meters in width. One of the features of the spreader is the speed of the rotating plate underneath the hopper is determined by the speed at which you push the spreader forward. The construction of this spreader um, is made up of its painted steel framework, um, the tough plastic hopper mounted on the top, and these are um, moulded plastic wheels underneath. This construction will mean that the spreader is largely rust resistant. Other alternatives include a towable version and a stainless steel version where greater rust resistance is required. Thanks very much for watching. Just give us a call if you need any further help and look forward to seeing you next time.